I am proud that our national athletes understand and accept this duty of national service. None of them has asked to be exempted from national service duties, including those who train hard and participated in recent regional and international events. They understand that everyone must fulfill their NS duties, even if you are a sporting or art talent. I also know that our national sportsmen want to do well in both, fulfill their national service duties, and also win medals for Singapore, at least some of them. Some have achieved it, but it's not easy to attain, and we must not set unrealistic expectations on all of them. However, for those who want to pursue both goals, MINDEF is prepared to allow more to disrupt, to train and compete in international competitions during their full-time national service. This is on the understanding that they fulfill the full period required after the disruption and also perform the NS duties satisfactorily while in national service. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. Mr. Leong Man Wai. Deputy Speaker. First of all, I thank the Minister for the clarification. I have two additional questions to ask. One, from what the Minister say, we have policies in place for deferment for uh, sportsmen and uh, performing arts uh, Singaporeans who can perform at the competitive and world level. But I think based on the uh, uh, reaction and the feedback from the athletes uh, recently that we uh, heard in the uh, papers, um, there seems to be uh, still insufficient leeway being given. So today, I would just now the minister did mention a little bit about. Uh, you just yeah. I've answered yeah. the question quite uh, adequately for uh, the member. I suggest he does not make another speech. Yeah. Mr. Leong, can you just ask your question? Okay, I, can I ask the minister again to confirm that? he will look into further relaxation for athletes who want to perform better okay, in, uh, uh, in their... Uh, Madam, can I answer the yeah. question? Yes. Madam, I've gone to great length answering the basis of our deferments and disruptions. And I think my answer speaks for itself. Thank you. Okay, thanks, uh, the Mr. Minister, Leong, for that. Uh, just, oh, no, I, Mr. Leong, do you wish to ask the question? Uh, I have asked the first question yeah, so already, so I have a second question. Okay, okay, please. My second question is that while the Minister has said that um, the personal uh, development should be secondary to, the, uh, uh, to national service, I think as our society becomes uh, more sophisticated, um, there's also a well, need... Order, Madam Deputy Speaker, is this a further point or a clarification? Uh, he's asking a question, so let... Uh, Mr Leong, I mean, please get to your question. So there's also a need for us to give more room for our talents to develop. And the situation we, are, we have... Mr. A Leong, please ask today, your question. Yes, we have a situation now today that while we are hindering the development of our sports and uh, arts talents by not granting them enough deferment in some cases, there are also a lot of citizens by registration that are Madam not Deputy performing... Madam Deputy Speaker, ends. I do not hear a clarification. Mr. Leong, I'm going to ask you one more time. Please ask your question, otherwise, uh, please take your seat. I thought I'm asking the question. Well, you're making a lot of statements. I haven't had okay. a question from you. Okay, so okay, let me ask the question again. Is it fair that while we are hindering the development of our talents by not, not granting them deferment, citizens by registration are also not doing NS? Minister? Mr. Deputy Speaker, that is an utter mischaracterization. Mr. Leung, the citizens by registration are not doing the national service. I think he's filed a separate question and I think he can read the reply. Mr. Leung, please Deputy take your seat now. Uh, no, Minister has answered I, I your question. I asked a question and the Minister said that uh, he's not answering the question. Your question is not related to the PQ you have asked. So please take a seat. Okay. Thank you.